couple days off. <laughs> I'm wearing my most comfortable stretchy pants and no bra, but lots of makeup. This is episode 7. I would just like to say marijuana is legal now, and I smoked some, and I'm enjoying it. The first rule of White Club is to quote the movie Tombstone. Can I call home all of your change I spend on you? That was awkward. That was the rewind button. Okay. I went to a gay hockey game and a fisting fight broke out. <laughs> Shut your dirty mouth. <laughs> I'm 45 years old and no one has ever offered me drugs. Do I not look like I would maybe enjoy some drugs? Do I have that I'm so uptight look that even drug dealers don't want to approach me? I feel like drug dealers are not just like approaching people anymore, but maybe I'm wrong. Bad shit crazy. Because I'm fucking fabulous, that's why I agree with this statement. Big bananas. El Chiquito Banana. I have to put on my sweater, so sorry, continuity. I remember her. I like her. I call my boobs Twin Peaks because they are also often described as bizarre and have a cult following. <laughs> I had stories. You guys don't want to listen. Your wife lied. She loves giving blowjobs, just not to you. would be interested if like dicks were actually out my father-in-law asked me you vote and I said yes women can vote now it's even encouraged he said you don't have to vote and I said well I also didn't have to marry your son but here we are probably like a whole fucking group of people who get together once a week to talk about that I know there is I forgot what it's called I'll get back to you on that <laughs> it might be a little bit stolen what will I do Due to the percentage of water they contain, most living things, including humans, are technically sauces. <laughs> Have you not seen Young Guns? Bitch, yeah. I love that movie and Emilio Estevez. So, Dave G. Matthews, apparently. I am always prepared to shit in the woods, even when I'm not in the woods. Tissue? Check. If this comes out on his next album... Welcome to the stage, ladies and gentlemen. Charity and Terrorists! No? I'm gonna start smoking just so I can stand outside alone every 15 minutes. I wish I wasn't smoking right now. I'm gonna put this cigarette out just to encourage other people to... I'm on... I'm on a tangent. Boom! He walks in. I'm like, bitch, just wait. Renee Libby! Can we all just agree to tell Donald Trump his dick is bigger than Barack Obama's and end this nightmare? I, I never do dick jokes, I swear. <laughs> Alright. Old Stad. I have decided I'm ready to become rich. Me too. Okay, it's gonna start raining right now. Five and ten dollar bills. <coughs> I only need a million dollars. Okay, yeah. let's try this again. Maybe the jacket is thrown out. I just heard this woman yelling, Melvin, Melvin, ugh, get over here, Melvin, don't make me say it again. And I was like, that kid is about to get beat. And then I heard a grown man say, sorry, honey, coming. <laughs> and I don't think I've ever appreciated bachelorhood so much. Fucking activate paper like this. Boom, Hindenburg style. Why is Trump so afraid of the rain? It's not holy water. Are you gonna post that? I'm gonna have some guy knocking on my door. You said something about Trump. The operator, and it's spelled S-A-D-E. How do you get shot out of that? I don't know, it's called the 90s. You know what? I'd be you too. We made it. Oh, excuse me. I hope you caught that. 
full HD sound. Son of like, a bitch. billion dollar idea to have a pay-per-view of the two of them just dicks off, like, you subscribe and you pay your fucking 30 bucks like you would for a fight, and then the two of them, it's like, you know, you have these other fucking congressmen and shit, they whip out their dicks to see who's the biggest, and then the fucking main event is Trump and fucking Barack Obama, and then Barack Obama's fucking dick is just, like, so big, he just fucking chokes him with it and stuff, and then takes over his seat as the fucking real leader.